Hey guys, AF Man here today with another video. So today is the day after Christmas, and I kind of just want to give you a collection update since 2018 is coming up. And the reason I haven't been uploading is because I haven't been feeling motivated lately. So I'm just going to briefly show you the collection and every single new piece I have got. So now, this shelf has not changed. This is the Avengers. Let's see, he's got four. Spider-Man. But well, down here is when it starts to change. Now, our first new addition. I'll just take him and put him on something else I got for Christmas. This TARDIS notebook it is Rocket Raccoon, the Marvel Legend. Finally got him... He's a really neat figure. Hold him up to the light, maybe. Yeah. He's very neat. He's very articulated, and I like him. Okay, I'm going to take out the other new figure I got for Guardians. Alright, I got the Toys R Us exclusive Groot. This figure is sweet. I don't know if I'm going to do a review on him or not, but we'll see. We'll see. He's a very tall figure. He's actually taller than the Hulk, making him the tallest figure on these shelves. Officially on these shelves. It also came with a baby Groot figurine. It's not posable or anything. It also came with this potted Groot, you know, before he sprouted legs. It's very neat. And over here, obviously, stuff gets exciting. X-Men. So, recently my aunt and uncle got me this two-pack with Cyclops here. And Dark Phoenix. I might do a review on these guys. I'm not sure yet. Leave a comment down below if I should do a review on these. Then, we move down here. We have another new figure. Let me try to move him. Show you him in more detail. Since you can obviously see this one, this is the Adam from the CW shows. Most, this is him from Legends of Tomorrow on the CW. Oops. He also came with a bonus mini Adam figure. Hold that up to the light so you can see it. It's very neat and it can stand on its own, which is really cool. I don't know if you can see that because my lighting sucks in here. I hope to get new lighting, and I'm going to be getting some new shelves. So, just be prepared for that. I'm just trying to set him up real quick. There we go. Over here we got something else that's exciting. Rick and Morty! Yeah. So, of course, we got Rick, Morty, you know, this is the crew. These figures are made by Funko. I've already done a review on Mr. Meeseeks. And I might review the rest of these. Actually, stay tuned, because I will review the rest of these. Yeah. That's it for action figures. Besides this notebook, I got a really neat toy. The Sonic Screwdriver from Doctor Who. Very neat. It is touch activated. You put your thumb on here. It lights up, makes sounds. And if you press down on it, it opens up. This is the 12th Doctor's. I don't know if any of you have ever known, but I am a huge fan of Doctor Who. And my, the 10th Doctor has always been my favorite. But, you know, the 12th Doctor is cool too. He's, you know, the older looking one. He even got a Lego set. Yeah. Very neat toy. Very, very neat. Also down here, already dropping things. Got a TARDIS keychain. It's neat. And down here I got my mini arcade machines. These things are neat. They look just like the arcades back in the 70s and 80s. And of course they work. I'll just show you that they work. I can't really play this one handed, but I'll just give you. See? You touch the joystick, he moves. I also have Frogger, which is my favorite. Press down. Go. 
just to show you that he works. I'm not trying to actually win, I'm just showing you that works. And I got another favorite of mine, Centipede. I'm just gonna show you that. He works. There. Sometimes these don't turn off right away, they're kinda weird. But these are very neat collectibles. I got, hold on. Sorry about that little pause. I was just setting these figures up. Because some of them fell. So you can definitely tell the collection has been expanding. And I I know this is a day late, but Merry Christmas. Sorry that it's a day late. I just was, you know, spending time with family on the holidays. So that's why I couldn't get a video up. I was very busy on Christmas Day. But, see how the collection is growing. I might post some of this stuff on Instagram. So, stay tuned for that. And, I want to thank you guys for, well, those guys that stuck with me. I know I've not uploaded a lot recently, just because of life kind of gets in the way sometimes. But once school is done with, I will continue to upload videos about, you know, action figures and collectibles and stuff like that. And this is only after coming up on my third year of collecting. It's ridiculous. I've been collecting since 2015. So this is my third anniversary of collecting action figures. And look how much I've gotten. For being on a budget, this is impressive. This is an impressive collection. Uh, yeah. So, Merry Late Christmas. And of course, 2018 is coming up. It's not too far away. The new year. I will probably do a special video documenting that. I'd like to thank you all for watching. And, you know, of course, click the thumbs up or like button. Of course, leave comments or suggestions down below of what I should do. Like figures I should review. Tell me if you want me to review those, you know, those new Marvel Legends or the Rick and Morty figures down there. Or even Daredevil or any of the new recent action figures I've purchased or received. And of course, subscribe to AF Man Reviews for hopefully a no year of videos to come. I'd like to thank you all for watching, and as always, have a nice day, night, or whatever time zone you're watching this video in currently. Goodbye, and I will see you in the next video. Stay tuned for more. Always.